as farm workers, we are living with well intentions of many people that thought they were doing what was best for us without asking us. Nobody knows us better than we do, and nobody's going to do for us like we can do for us. The University of Washington's Department of Environmental and Occupational Health Sciences is partnering with farm workers in Whatcom and Skagit counties and other UW researchers to improve access to health care for farm workers. So what makes this project unique is that the community um, is really leading the way. The study is a collaboration between the farm worker community and the School of Public Health, the School of Medicine, and the School of Social Work. The goal of this project is to really have their voices heard, to really help them have a broader voice um, through both research and, and hopefully policy. It is really important for us to have a voice to be able to find the solutions for ourselves. Because we do know what we want, it is just that sometimes there isn't anyone willing to listen to us. Researchers are surveying farm workers in Whatcom and Skagit counties and conducting in-depth home assessments to evaluate farm workers' health and living conditions. The blueberries are low on the ground. By the end of the day, my back aches. In the morning, I may wake up and say, I don't want to work today. But one still has to go. Information is also gathered from devices that measure environmental conditions. The data are being collected by promotores, local trusted health educators who are already well known in the community. No one has done surveys with farm workers. No one has asked them what their needs are. Um, and as researchers, this is where we can use our capacity and our skills to be able to help identify some of those questions that they have. Two years ago, I got sick and we went to seek help. If you don't have a good insurance, you don't qualify for help. Later on, when I was almost dying, I went to the hospital and the issue was my kidneys that were in critical condition. They have the right to live in an environment free of pollution. They have the right to breathe clean air. They have the right to drink clean water. They have the right to have nothing in their environment that could harm their health. Let's figure out a way that together we can lead ourselves to equity, to a better life. We're asking for a place at the table to be able to say, this is what's good for us, this is what's bad for us, let's figure out how to fix it.